Hey guys, that is from Drone Optics Parts here, bringing you a teardown video of the brand new DJI FPV drone. I'll kick it off by peeling all the stickers, removing the gimbal cover and the battery. After that's done, we will work on removing the canopy. Remove these 8 screws, remove the plastic shroud from the front of the drone, pop open the bottom corners of the canopy and with some help from a prying tool, push on the back of it to set it loose. Next, by removing these 5 screws, we will take off the metal protective piece that's in the way. Following the metal piece is the camera and gimbal assembly. It easily comes off after 3 screws are taken out, but be careful, it is still connected by a wire. While still holding the camera, take off the metal connector plate, pop off the camera wire connector and carefully peel it off of the black tape. Important not to rush here, as the cable can be easily damaged. Next off, the IMU module. It is held on by 3 screws and once they come off, pop off the ribbon connector and carefully remove the ribbon cable from the glue. It's time to take the GPS board out. We'll start off by removing the antenna cables. Two screws hold it in place. One of which also holds the metal tab protecting a ribbon connector, so we start off by removing that one first. After the GPS is out, we can start on removing all the screws that are either on the metal bracket or are attaching it to the frame. There are a total of 6 screws holding it in the battery tray. We will also be removing these antenna connectors and the ESC covering plate to reveal another ribbon connector that needs to come off. It's time to take off the obstacle avoidance module. It's only held on by two screws but needs to be pushed back to be released from the plastic tabs. Two screws on the back of the module are holding a metal tab to release the ribbon cable. Once the module is off, we can take the plastic cover under it off by removing six screws that are on the frame and two from the front legs. The legs need to be pushed off a little to free up the cover. At this point, after removing the tiny mic connectors and freeing up this ribbon from the frame, we can remove the metal bracket holding the flight controller in place. To free up the flight controller boards, we will be removing all the screws and ribbon cables. Once everything is taken off, the board can be removed with a prying tool. Expect some resistance as the thermal paste is holding the boards down. This and many more parts can be found at our online store at droneoptics.repair. The fan offers resistance due to the double-sided tape on the bottom, so a prying tool and some patience is required. Be careful with the copper heat pipe in the metal frame as bending it will damage it beyond repair. To remove the ESC board, firstly we will desolder all the wires and after removing the bottom screws and slightly lifting the board, we get easier access to the four LED connectors. Removing the rest of the frame screws and the two screws holding the back legs allows us to remove the back legs.
By carefully releasing the cable from the frame, we can now also remove the front legs. After the legs are out, we can also remove the microphones and the antennas located on the sides of the drone. Be very careful and work slow with the antennas, as they are stuck on the foam that is double-sided taped to the frame and can easily be broken. Follow these foamless grooves for an easier removal. The prop quick release plates are held by three screws and easily come off after they are taken out. By removing these screws from the front legs, we reveal the antenna, LEDs and the three screws holding the motor in place, which I will be leaving in as I don't want to damage the wires of the motor. The same screws on the back legs reveal the same motor screws as well as a glued-in LED module that would require careful prying to be taken out. I hope you found this guide helpful. If you are after some parts or accessories for your drone, please check out our website at droneoptics.repair where we stock parts for all DJI as well as Parrot and Unique drones. We are based in UK but we ship globally.